Thanks, Justin. Okay, it's a record for the San Antonio City Council. They adopted a $3.1 billion budget for the city. Of that total, more than $13 million is going to go toward the newly formed San Antonio Department of Transportation. Max Massey spoke with the new director of the department who's emphasizing plans for safety and walkability. Recently, the San Antonio City Council adopted a $3.1 billion budget, and part of that budget is the future of the San Antonio infrastructure. Joined here with the new director of transportation right here in San Antonio. So what does the future of transportation look like? The future of transportation is bright. It's very, very bright. Integrating more bicycle infrastructure, integrating safe sidewalks in partnership with the Public Works Department, and most importantly, our Vision Zero projects in the next year are going to change the way in which people can actually literally cross the street. We're proposing with this budget 28 mid-block crossings across the city, across approximately nine corridors. From 2014 to 2018, we've lost a lot of lives. I often say that every month that I've been here in the city, we've, we've lost a life. That's something that has to change, and that's what Vision Zero is about. It's about getting to zero fatalities and injuries. Also, in the next year, we're going to start our bicycle master plan update. And with that master plan update, we're going to do something amazing and integrate the Howard Peak Trail Network into our bicycle master plan. We need to listen, we need to learn, and we need to do it safely and provide the community with the tools that they need in order to develop develop the land use, complement the sustainable goals of the city, and also support our SA Tomorrow program. All right, so a safer and more walk-friendly and biking-friendly San Antonio. Yes, sir. That's the goal. All right, Tamika, thank you so much. Thank you, Max. If you guys have any questions, we have all those answers. Just head to KSAT.com. Max Massey, KSAT 12 News.